Hello everyone, PrePrescriptionLenses.com here where everyone loves a bargain and no one is disappointed with quality. I am Seymour Better, but call me Mo, Mo Better, because I might see Mo Better looking Mo Better and then show everybody else how I bring that loving feeling back to glasses. And I want to take a minute today to talk to you and show you some blue light lenses that are currently available. Now everyone's got an opinion on blue light. Some people love it. Some people are ambivalent. Some people think it's a waste of time. It just depends on the individual. I have some people who swear by them. Other people who can't tell the difference. You know, today's electronic devices such as cell phones, tablets, computer screens, and of course the number one source of blue light on the planet. Anyone? Anyone? Bueller? That's right, it's the sun. The source of life on this planet. But, some of the side effects or the effects of blue light is... You know, sleep disruption. Some people say it causes ADD in kids. It uh, what are some of the things? It could be the you know earlier onsets of cataracts, or actually, excuse me, excuse me. I'm sorry. I meant to say macular degeneration, which there is no cure for. So, if it does anything, if it helps with the onset of that, that is miraculous in and of itself. But we won't know that till the ends of our life before we're losing sight. But I do have some people who swear by it. It takes away eye fatigue late in the day. It just depends on how sensitive you are to light in that spectrum and how much time you spend at a computer. Now, a lot of cell phones and screens have blue light protection built into it. There's a dimmer switch, but it could go on and on and on. And, of course, I have to get eight hours of continuing education every year for my license, and there was one time... I was at a lecture on this and I asked about how can we really know whether it, these lenses protect you. The lecturer said that's a very good question and then continued on with his lecture. So, but the three most current lenses are the, that you have seen and are currently available are the Blue Tech lenses, which were the first ones on the market and have a yellowish brown hue to them. Now, we're supposed to call this a champagne color, like that's going to make it more appealing to you. but. Uh, a lot of people make them feel like they look like they have jaundice with this lens. Now, I do have one gamer that loves it just for the cosmetic look. He thinks that just looks really cool while he's playing his computer games. Eventually, he's going to have to get a job. But the next on the market was a clearer lens from Essilor called Cruzal Provencia. It sells for $119 on top of the uh, of your free load. When you purchase any frame from me, you get one set of free prescription lenses. The Crizal Provencia adds $119 to it. It is before then it was revolutionary, is mostly clear, has the slightest bit of yellowish brown hue compared to this lens. And then now I've been an Essilor man for literally all of my career. My lab equipment is Essilor. I've been doing that, wore it myself for years. I've switched to Zeiss since they had the Generation 8 transitions before Essilor did. In fact, Zeiss invented transitions. Well, they invented photochromic lenses. Then after seven years when their patent ran out, they sold it to other labs such as Essilor, who branded it as transition. Zeiss also invented anti-glare. And again, they had the only ones using it for seven years. Their patent ran out. They sold it to other labs, to Shamir, to Hoya, to Essilor, and Essilor calls it Crizal. But they have the Zeiss Blue Protect, which is the clearest of any of the lenses. Now, as you notice, these have a purplish hue to it because they're blocking light in the ultraviolet spectrum. The Crizal Provencia is rather pronounced. Now, women never minded this lavender look, but some men just did not like this purplish hue the, um, to the lenses, the reflection. Zeiss has much less of that, much less of a reflection. So it's not only clearer, when you hold it over something white, the purplish hue is much less pronounced on the Zeiss and it is $20 less. It is $100 versus $120. So this is the generation of lenses we have, the Blue Tech. Which, believe it or not, this is their indoor version. They have an outdoor version that's even darker. You have a choice from that. The indoor, making it clearer. Yes, that is the clearer lens compared to their outdoor lens. Crizal Provencia. And now the Zeiss Blue Protect. Now, I'm a couple weeks away. This is November 16th of 2020. I'm a couple weeks away from having my new website. 
that will have all of these on there for you to choose from. I just wanted you to be able to see it. Maybe I can put this in the frequently asked questions this video to help you decide which one you want. I personally am a fan of the Blue Protect. I have it on my lenses, on my transitions, and I mean, I'm on my hour, my computers for hours every night before going to bed, and I sleep like a baby. But then again, after a 15-hour work day, I, I sleep pretty well. 12 to 15 hours. So 12 hours is my half day. Literally, it's half of a day, my 12-hour work day. And there are other days when things are good, I work 12 hours. When things are great, I work 15 hours a day. But enough about me. Which lens will you choose from me? <laughs> the guy with the two thumbs and the bad joke. So, if you have any questions, you can go to the Contact Me page of the website. You can also leave a question or comment in the comment section below. I'm not here to tell you the definitive, definitive wisdom of all the knowledge out there. The common phrase on the internet now is do your research, which does not mean just watching this video. Keep doing more, have you decide. But if it is a concern of yours, and you want the clearest lens possible, I would go with the Zeiss Blue Protect. The next one is Crizol Provencia. Again, for the Zeiss is $100 add-on. The Crizol Provencia is $120, and these are $60. I can get the Essilor Crizol Provencia and the Zeiss Blue Protect in any power. The Blue Tech lenses only go up to two diopters of astigmatism correction. So if you have over two diopters, we're gonna have to go to a different route. But that's it. Thanks for watching. I know I've opened up a can of worms and possibly you have even more questions now, but we'll cross that bridge. But thanks for watching and hopefully now you've seen how I bring that confusing but loving feeling back to glasses. Thank you.